I want to all of you to close your eyes. Close your eyes. You're walking down your street. And you're walking down, you're going to come home, you're going to relax. You're going to be with family. And, but there are certain fake people in your family that you're probably, you know, whatever, you're not happy. But you're coming home. And as you're coming towards your house, you can see an ambulance outside your house. There's a crowd, your neighbors are outside. People in locality are outside. So you start to jump. And you're thinking now, where's this? Because it's right in front of your house right now, right in front of your house. And you can see a stretcher coming out of your house. The hospital people are bringing a stretcher outside your house. And you go up to that and you look at that and you've only got seconds to see. And you see that that person in your family who you had grudges with is on that stretcher. Open your eyes. That's it. They passed away. They're gone. Whatever it was, they're gone. They're dead. Your grudges, everything have gone. You're not thinking about, are you thinking about grudges right now? Are you thinking about grudges right now? If it was your mother, if it was your sister, if it was someone who you had some grudge with, and that person passed away, that person dead. And you never ever got the chance to talk about your problems to them. Never got the chance to get their forgiveness or to forgive them. Would you feel happy right now? Yes or no? Yes or no? No. Everyone's saying no. I want you to do one thing. Your sister, your brother, your sibling, your child, your parent, whoever they are, tomorrow they could be dead. Tomorrow, literally, they could be dead. Go home, my brothers. Go home, my sisters. And go. Doesn't matter what grudge you've got. I want you to go first. Your own blood, your family member. I want you to go home straight away. Say salam to them. And give them a hug. Give them a hug. They're going to, they're going to be surprised. What are you giving him a hug for? Give him a hug. I want you to sit down and say, if I died right now, or if you died right now, how will we feel about each other? And try and make it work. How you're going to try and make it work is that you're going to show love. Don't talk about them not showing you love. You don't want to wait till the day of judgment. Some people think that if I wait till the day of judgment, I'm going to get more. No, 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 I tell you. If you can get your forgiveness in this world, or you can forgive them in this world, you get a lot more than waiting till the Day of Judgment. That's clear in Hadith. If you wait till the Day of Judgment, yes, you can sort it out there. And you can wait till Allah gives you certain reward from them. You can wait then. But the reward you will get, the greatest Jannah that you will get, that Allah has written for you is from forgiveness in this world, if you can do that right now.